to be having lots of lovely stuff. We're going to have... Establish my covenant with you. Need to do something like you that our father like God, God is all knowing. That means He knows everything. He went he knows ahead. Everything and He knows tomorrow. An art. Like I'm so silly. You like you're, you're so silly out. Like you're so guess a, what? You know you just need all the same, right? So and never you feel pressure to do the wrong thing. Never. Hello, boys and girls. Welcome back to the Solid Rocks Children's Church. We have loads and loads of activities today. We have the worship time. We're going to have the memory verse, and you know we always have a quiz, and then we have the uh, lesson. Remember, it's from this lesson that the assignment comes from. So make sure, boys and girls, that you pay attention so that you'll be able to answer all your questions correctly. You know what happened last week? You know, that we got gift. As many children that answered the questions correctly and so many people that are doing their memory verse, everyone that is participating one way or the other are getting, you know, one gift or the other. So make sure, boys and girls, that you don't miss out on any of this gift. And I will see you at the lesson. God bless you. Hello, friends. It's another time to give God praise and to celebrate His love. And we're going to sing about His love today. Are you ready? Love is patient. Woo! Your love is kind. Oh, your love is patient. Yeah, you feel my heart. Oh, with so much peace and joy. Hey, your arm. You make my life feel brand new Oh, you're amazing You make my life feel brand new Let's sing now, your love is kind, let's go Your love is kind Come on, come on, say Your love is patient you feel my heart, say You feel my heart With so much, with so much peace and joy Now let's say you're amazing, say You're amazing Yes, Lord You make my life feel brand new You're amazing You're amazing Let's sing it together, say Jesus, you love me too much, oh Too much, oh Too 
macho, excess love, oh. Do your hand like this to say excess love. Come Jesus, you love it too much, oh. Too much, oh. Too much, oh. Excess love, oh. Let's sing it one more time. Say. Love it too much, oh. Too much, oh. Too much, oh. Excess love, oh. Let's take it back to the top. Everybody sing now. Say. Your love is kind, oh, oh, yeah. Your love is patient. How you feel my heart, you feel my heart, heart, yeah. With so much peace and joy. Everybody say you're amazing. You're amazing. You make my you make my life feel brand new Say you're amazing, you're amazing You make my, you make my life feel brand new Say Jesus now Jesus, you love me too much, oh Too much, oh, too much, oh, excess love, oh Somebody celebrate the love of Jesus Let's listen to the memory verse for the week. Hi guys, my name is Vanessa and I'm about to do a memory verse, which is Matthew chapter 7 verse 24 to 25. Therefore, everyone who hears these words of mine is, and puts them into practice is like a wise man who built his house on the rocks. The wind, the wind came down the stream rose and the winds blew and beat against that house. Yet it did not fall because it had its foundation on the rocks. For the lesson for the week, please listen carefully. Stories of the Bible The Parable of the Two Builders. This is Jesus. Hey -o. who is the Son of God and the Savior of the world. While Jesus was on earth, he taught everyone about God's love and healed people from their sickness. He did many miracles like walking on water. Oh, hey guys. And even raised people from the dead. Uh, Wahoo! One day, as he saw the crowds gathering, Jesus went up to the mountainside and sat down. His disciples gathered around him and he began to teach them. He asked them, why do you keep calling me Lord, Lord, when you don't do what I say? Anyone who listens to my teaching and follows it is wise. Hey, I'm gonna build here. Yeah, I'm gonna build out there. All right, suit yourself. like a person who builds a house on solid rock. Oh, yeah! When the floodwaters rise and break against that house, it stands firm because it was well built. I'll get it here. But anyone who hears my teaching and doesn't obey it is foolish. Like a person who builds a house on sand. Uh oh. When the rains and floods come and the winds beat against that house, it will collapse with a mighty crash. When Jesus had finished saying these things, the crowds were amazed at his teaching. Hello boys and girls, I hope you're having a happy new year so far. Right, so this is today's quiz. It's a bit different, so please pay more attention. In this quiz, you need to complete the sentence, okay? Number one, Matthew chapter 7, verse 24, NIV, says... 
Therefore, everyone who hears these words of mine and puts them into practice is like the answer is Matthew 7 verse 24 says therefore everyone who hears these words of mine and puts them into practice is like a wise man who built his house on the rock okay the next gap to fill in number two matthew 7 verse 25 says the rain came down the streams rose and the winds blew and beat against that house yet it did not fall what completes the sentence you can complete that sentence in number two with yet it did not fall because it had its foundation on the rock all right number three we should have a hang of it by now Matthew 7 verse 26 NIV says but everyone who hears these words of mine and does not put them into practice is like a the answer is like a foolish man who built his house on sand Number four and the last question for today's quiz. Matthew 7 verse 29 NIV. The crowd was amazed at Jesus' teaching because he taught as... Because he thought as one who had authority and not as their teachers of the law all right that was today's quiz now it's time for the home quiz so as you know your assignment is the first correct answer gets a gift in church so ask your parents to use the email address for the church which is kidszone at solidrockdublin.org to submit your answer So the home quiz is another complete the sentence. So number one is Luke chapter 6 verse 46. And it says, why do you call me Lord, Lord and beep? The beep is where you put the answer in. So number one says Luke chapter 6 verse 46. Why do you call me Lord, Lord and beep? Number two, Luke chapter 6, verse 47, NIV. As for everyone who comes to me and hears my words and puts them into practice, I will show you what they are like. Verse 48, they are like a man building a house who dug down deep and beep. And the last question, number three, is from Luke chapter 6 verse 49 NIV but the one who hears my words and does not put them into practice is like a man who built a house on the ground without a beep so if you have the correct answers put them in an email send them to the church email which is kidszone at solidrockdublin.org
from featuring me in the home right? Today we are going to be having lots of lovely stuff. We are going to have... Establish my covenant with you. Into the world and to do something like build an ark for like God. God. He's all knowing. That means he knows everything. everything. He went he ahead. Everything. He knows tomorrow. An ark. Like I'm so telling silly. You, like you're, you're so silly. Out. Like you're. So but guess what? You know you're just made all this silly, right?